a local artist who's also a volunteer at the Hack Lab in North Boynton. Hi, I'm Sarah Younger. I also am an artist and resident of Palm, of Palm Beach County in Boynton Beach. I was attracted to the city of Boynton Beach for my art work as they have a great program around eco art and their green buildings initiative. And public art is also a uh, declared priority in this city. I'm excited about participating in this project because it's a way to work, it's a grassroots way to work with the community. So when you get a group like this from multi-disciplines and you're working with the community trying to figure out different ways, we came up with the kinetic sculpture. There is a, a lot of interest right now in how communities form around uh, sustainability and resilience. Uh, resiliency is a, is a term that's used for mitigating and adapting strategies. It, it's going to require all of our citizens to find our way through the coming decades. And that's why art has a unique place to play on that, as it, it helps people to feel that they're working on a positive and creative output to, uh, towards that. We're going to have a permanent website and also with social media. This way we can have uh, the community's input. Uh, they're giving their feedback and also their way of participating and being part of the project. We are also excited about introducing our project to the community at large to invite more members in. Our group has been working on the matter of sustainability, a major issue here in South Florida. Our challenge today in South Florida is really how do we address the many ch uh, changes to our environment and demonstrate new techniques and, and strategies to mitigate and our risks. And uh, here in South Florida, of course, we're looking at how to create a sustainable future for our children. The sculpture becomes a symbol where it's the whole computer community has put the effort together to create this, but also it's, it's you, you become a stakeholder. You, you put a commitment in there into the community. Introducing people to the water problems that we face, uh, to understanding the waste cycle, to learning about alternative energy. These are things that are not somewhere in the distant future, but are actually today's concerns. And so by bringing them together in, an, in a creative way so that uh, students, our young people, and um, business leaders, civic leaders, multi-general, right, operational, will all be able to, to, um, to engage on this um, project.